Hello, uh, I'm Dr. Erica Anderson from the Nadiri Center, and I'm the breast and body specialist here at our center. And I wanted to talk today just a little bit about um, the breast implants that are currently being utilized, and specifically what I mean when I talk to patients about cohesive gel. So when patients come in to see me about breast augmentation, often they're worried about silicone gel. Silicone has a bad reputation. Um, today's implants are called cohesive gel implants, and for that reason, I want to show you what I mean by cohesive gel. In my consults, I talk about if the outer shell loses its integrity, it's no longer a gel. It's a semi-solid. It has stickiness. It sticks to itself as opposed to leaking out like the old implants of previous generations. So this uh, is an implant that inadvertently got damaged in surgery, but what I want to show you is that this is the gel on the inside you can see is sticky so it doesn't leak it sticks to itself um, and it's you know tacky you see you can sort of see how it it's not gonna leak out into your body um, so if the outer shell of a gel current gel implant is damaged in some way or over time gets a, a, an injury or, or damages like this you can be confident that that gel is not leaking into your body so they are safe, um, they feel great, they look great. Um, there's no reason not to consider yourself um, to use these gel implants for breast augmentation. Um, but again, I just wanted to show you what that cohesive gel actually means these days. So hopefully that's illustrative um, of that. Um, with these gel implants, what we recommend is that you have an MRI three years after implantation and then every two years thereafter, just to make sure you haven't had a loss of the outer shell or integrity of that outer shell. Um, that's just what we uh, recommend at this point. So this again is just to show you cohesive gel technology, current implants that are utilized. They come in all shapes and sizes for everybody um, to use. They are safe. Um, if you're interested in breast augmentation or a revision to your breast augmentation or a lift with an augmentation, just need a little more volume, consider gel implants, cohesive gel implants. Come see me at the Nadiri Center. We're happy to do a FaceTime consultation if you'd like. We'd love to help you through this process. This again is Dr. Erica Anderson talking about cohesive gel implants from the Nadiri Center. Um, let us know if we can help in any way.